saying that it came up. But yeah, I don't usually I don't usually cough that often. Usually it's just like I get all sneezy when I'm sick. So I'm not used to having a cough, which isn't fun. But uh, hopefully that goes away in a little week or so. Just had it. Like I've uh like after the first week I was okay. But uh I felt like with my throat being the way it was, I probably couldn't do long streams. Or like long form content, so I couldn't really talk that much. So I did I did get some TikTok stuff done. I've just been covering game news over there. I've covered a lot of game news. There's been a lot going on. Um trying to do like three stories in a day over there. And again, some days, some, some days not. But yeah, there's been stuff going on the arcades as well and everything. And you, you can't have your music. The music got loud. Why is the music so loud? It should be very fine compared to me. Hold on. Uh. Yeah, it should be like 15 dec decibels lower than me. Well, it should be okay now anyway. But yeah, where was I? Uh, yeah, no, I've just been covering a lot of gaming news. There's been a lot going on. So, that's what I've been up to. And, um, a little bit of gardening today. I used, I used the hoe in real life. I didn't hear a single word I said. I don't know why. That's weird. Oh! Oh! The music was coming through the mic, that's why. You can still... <laughs> okay, I know what was happening there. So, um... The way I've got recording set up for stuff... I've got like a mixer and it was like... Piping the, uh, the music through my microphone. Which... <laughs> is a bit of a pain, but the music should be a lot lower now. Let me actually turn that up a little bit. Because what it's supposed to do is it's supposed to get quieter when I talk. Which it doesn't do when it's piping through the mic. I was like, what? I can't hear you. Yeah, we were just... It, it's like, you know, we were in the club. And, and you just got really loud music. And you, I'm just having to shout. But, uh... Yeah, no, um... So, I survived the COVID. I was just saying how it's... It's just a case of, like, over here now. Everyone thinks the pandemic's over. Because, like, the government, you know, rolled back all the restrictions and stuff. So, everyone's getting it over here now. Like, it's pretty much, pretty much everyone I've spoken to has, like, had someone that's got it recently. Which, you know, isn't great. But it is what it is. It's what I have to deal with living here. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I escaped it for so long. For so, so long. I, it just annoys me that I got it, you know? I was I was saying I was uh, fine after the first week, but my throat was like a bit out of it, so I didn't want to do streams. I was trying to avoid it just because I didn't want to mess my throat up even more. But yeah, I've just got like a bit of a cough now, so hopefully, you know, we'll be all good and I'll be 100% again next week. But uh, yeah, I, I think I'm good enough to at least stream now. I don't think my uh, I don't think I'm gonna get a sore throat again. What I was doing actually was I was, uh, the day I got it, I was practicing <laughs> voice acting stuff. Sorry, I coughed there. But yeah, I was practicing some voice acting stuff that I was doing. Because, you know, I want to get into that a bit more. So, <laughs> I was doing voices and stuff, and then I, at the end of the day, my throat was kind of sore, and I was like, oh, okay, maybe it was just because I was doing voices. It was not because I was just doing voices. It was the Rona. But, uh, yeah. So, I had a couple of weeks off, um, and then after the first week, I could do short stuff, so I was covering, like, gaming news over on the TikTok, because that's what I've been doing a lot of. Um, been, like, doing free a day over there. I've been trying to, at least. I might post it on Instagram as well, maybe. I don't know. I don't know where else to post it, but I want to do... I want to do more gaming news stuff, because I enjoy doing that. Like, the podcast... We used to do game news stuff all the time, so I really enjoy it. I just, you know, I don't have like a, <laughs> I guess a place to vent it, you know. So that's what I've been doing with the TikTok, and maybe I'll, I'll probably do more of it on here. Maybe just talk about stuff. There's been a lot going on, like with Arcage, um, 
I think, I think they had like a live stream that I haven't watched and then there was like some rumors about NFTs coming into it. So I need to look into that. <laughs> but uh, yeah, hold on. Let me go ahead and actually get into game as well. Been rambling a lot. I should just be on just chat at this point. It's kind of nice to just talk a bit at the start though. Oh my god, he's back from the dead. I am back from the dead, Calwin. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, the uh, the Rona got me for a bit, so I was out of it. Still playing that dead game. Wait, which one? <laughs> Arcade, you lost duck. Also, welcome, Moharoi. Um, yeah, I need to watch the cacao now um, that they did. Happens to the best of us. Yeah, I um survived though. I'm still here. Just um, it's been a lot that I've been trying to get into. Like, I was just saying, I was, I'm covering, like, gaming news every day over on TikTok now. That's a thing I'm doing. Trying to get more YouTube stuff out. I'm, like, th there was the two weeks where I just couldn't do anything long form, which sucks. But I've at least got some stuff written up for the YouTube now. Oh, did Mod get the uh, the runner again as well? Oof, is he, uh, is he doing alright? I've not spoke to Mod in a while, honestly. I've, I've, I don't know, I've not been finding time to like talk or hang out with anyone recently i guess you know the rona got me for a couple of weeks so i was just out of action but yeah i've not i'm not uh, caught up with him in a while i think the last time i saw him he was playing new world so you know that speaks for how long ago that was also i'm getting a bit of lagging game let me close chrome because i'm 90 percent sure chrome is causing it might be a bit more also you know what we don't need the music on we need the Lost Ark sound is what we need. There we go. Got a nice, peaceful Lost Ark music. Uh, yeah, it's starting to feel better. All right, that's good. That's good to hear. You just pop into Twitch from time to time. You're playing a bit of Final Fantasy 14 together. I really need to get into 14 still. But, um... Yeah, I've got so much. I'm trying to... Like, Lost Ark, I'm still... I'm still going out. There was like, again, a couple of weeks where I wasn't really doing much on it. Just because, I guess, the Rona. I don't know what happened in that week. I feel like I got nothing done. But yeah, I'm still doing Lost Ark. Uh, Star Wars The Old Republic, I still want to grind through. Because I really want to get into that. And then, um, and then I'll probably jump on Final Fantasy. And I'll actually give it a proper go. Because like, I played a little bit of it. Um, I got to like level 20. But I wasn't really playing with anyone. And, um, I was, rec I was recording stuff for it, but what I do is I always record and r I'll write like a script for like video stuff. And then for some reason I get, a uh, I don't know, I get weird about it and I just don't like the script and I end up scrapping it. You lost your drive, lost dog. You're still playing some, but you kind of lost your drive for it right now. That's fair enough. Did you get to, uh, the TFRA? Because I know a lot of people... Probably lost the driver tier three. I'm still on tier two. I've been taking it very slowly. Just relaxing, chilling. As you can tell, I spend most of my time AFK. Ooh. Is the stream laggy by chance? Because I'm I'm feeling a bit of FPS lagging here. Still tier two, but almost tier three. Okay, yeah, fair enough. Yeah, I um I've been going slowly with it. I think um what okay, score am I right now? 990, okay, so. You know, I'm, I'm getting... I have a lot of these stone selection pouches, so I could, probably could just open these and go straight up to tier 3, but I want to save these for the tier 3 stones. I don't know if that's more worth it to do. I feel like it is, but I don't know. Also, um, there's a bunch of free stuff on Lost Ark right now if you haven't played already, so... They've given out a piece of furniture, which is this... Universal Lost Ark sign, which has um, a bunch of Makokos on the top of it, which is very silly. And I do, <laughs> I like that to thing. It's pretty cool. They also gave us a free, um, a free mountain pet as well. So for the pet, there's this rainbow Makoko, which. You can actually choose the colors. There's several colors, but I went with rainbow because it actually changes colors. And I thought that was pretty cool. 
And then I also got the rainbow board to match. Which is kind of cool. It also makes the Makoko sound when you get on it, which I've only just realized. <laughs> when I actually brought it out, I wasn't actually... I never actually had the sound on, so I didn't hear that. Yeah, the board changes color, which is cool. I think there's also like a, a Starry Night one as well, where the stars travel up it, which I thought was cool as well. And it was hard to choose between these two, but, you know, more colors. <laughs> so that's what I ended up going with. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. Um, I still like this guy the best. Stick to my horse. I'm thinking about going back to BDO with the new expansion coming out soon. I I really wish I could have got into BDO. I don't know what it is. I played BDO several times. I played it when it first came out with my pocket healer from Arcage. Me and I played it for a bit and then I don't know what happened. I just never got into it right away. And then I've came back to it several times. Like when they brought out the Samurai class, the uh, Musa. And then I think they brought out, there was another class they brought out that I came back for as well. Trying to think what I originally played. I think they had like a striker or a like martial arts type one as well. And uh, I think there was like a shinobi class. Oh, they brought they brought out a uh, oh, what is it called? The like Middle Eastern assassins. Oh. Uh, I don't know what the name is, but I think you know what class I'm talking about. So I'm trying to think. I was moving and came back and started making a Nova. I actually don't know what a Nova is. Maybe I missed on that one. Yeah. The, I thought the Musa was really cool. So I played that quite a bit. You know, I just like playing a Samurai. But yeah, I've, I've, there's probably a lot I've missed out on in that game. Honestly, I really want a new PC. That's what I really need to get because I think BDO is actually a pretty intense game. I think it probably, I probably wouldn't be able to stream it. My PC, I'd probably just die. Oh. <laughs> and there's 10 minutes on the aviators. Welcome, welcome, Stephanie. We're just uh, talking a lot. I've recovered from the COVID. We're, um, yeah, a lot of MMOs that I want to play. Too many MMOs. There's too many MMOs and not enough time, you know? I, because I would like to get into BDO, but I also want to get into Final Fantasy 14. But at the same time, I'm in the middle of Lost Ark and Star Wars The Old Republic. And then Arcage, I, I still want to keep tabs on. Um, I feel somewhat, I don't know, some responsibility to keep making videos on that. I don't know. But I want to look into the Kakao Now uh, stream. I want to watch that at some point. Maybe, I don't know whether to do like a react video to it or something. And there's probably not much to react to though. But, um. I've heard about NFT rumors as well. So I need to look into that as well. So, they're my plans. I honestly want to do a whole video essay on NFTs. I lost help for Arcage and Channel. It has to be done before I would go back. Yeah, no, I think, um. I think a lot of people. Feel that way. I'm very demotivated with it now as well. Yeah, Archworld is the NFT game. But yeah, I've seen a lot of people saying it's Arcade just getting NFTs, which I don't think is true. I think it's just the Archworld thing. So I might do some something talking about that. Um, NFTs. Uh, it's weird. There's a lot. There's a lot to talk about with NFTs. I think. I think, unfortunately, I think NFTs are going to become a part of gaming. Like, they're going to, much like microtransactions have snuck their way in over time. Like, in the past, we didn't even like DLCs. We, we didn't like DLCs, the games. Um, expansions, people didn't like. And then microtransactions, people complained about 
and then it sort of became okay in multiplayer games because of free to play games and the whole live service idea and then um they started coming into like single player games like dead space free and everyone rioted over that but over time like <laughs> more and more games now have those single player microtransactions For me, it's Star Citizen and Ashes of Creation alongside my usual comfy Care Bear-like games. Yeah, I really want to... I want to try Star Citizen. My PC's not going to be able to handle it, though. I already know that. Um, I've, I think there was, like, a flight test or something, and I just... It wasn't happening. <laughs> we'll say that much. So I need to upgrade, especially before Ashes of Creation comes out, because I really want to... I really want to dive into that game. I think I'm going to really enjoy Ashes of Creation. Uh, let me go ahead and check here real quick. Take your time. I want to stay as long as possible. Yeah, I can't wait for Ashes of Creation. Yeah, um, the thing with Ashes is the guy behind it, Stephen Sharif, is that his name? I think that's how his last name's pronounced. He, like, his big inspiration is Arcage, Arcage and Lineage. So... He's going to take, like, the best elements of those games. And hopefully it turns out to be really cool. So I'm really looking forward to seeing how it looks. Hope he bought me a package and a few ships. Going to be a space cabber. Going to collect all the plushies in the vest. <laughs> hey, you know what? That's fair enough. I I really want to try it. I, one of my dream... Like, my dream games is kind of like Star Citizen. I just like the idea of... You know, having a big ship and having a whole crew man in it of players. And then... I, I want, like... I want you to just be able to do anything sci-fi in that game, though. I want you to be able to get an escape pod, crash into someone else's ship, and breach it. <laughs> but, um... Like, that's a thought I had for it. an MMO in the past. And Star Citizen is shaping to be, you know, close to that. It's not going to be exact, but, uh... You know, when Star Citizen comes out, that is. It's been, it's been in, you know, in early access for a while now. But I heard it is getting updates and it's doing okay. He's been building a new PC. He got a bunch of upgrades. I think I'll get some hand-me-downs for a, uh, a streaming PC. Yeah, I, uh, I, I honestly need to get something like that myself. <laughs> uh, because, um... It is de it's definitely nice to have a separate streaming PC. So just completely take the load off your gaming PC. If I'm playing Elden Ring, I will do it on stream. And I I need I do need to get a uh, another PC for that, I think. Because I know this PC can't run it. 100%. But, like, I want the smoothest experience possible with that game. I don't know why, but I, r I really find Souls games relaxing. Like, I enjoy those games. Which I know, I know it's not everyone's experience, but, uh, but yeah. Hold on, you know what, I want to put some of these cards away real quick. Mm, just close all that. I'll stream Star Citizen once you have the uh, the streaming PC. Yeah, I'll try and pop by and catch it when you are are on Stephanie because I, I do think that game is really cool. I really like. I don't know. I I've always liked um like space and flying and stuff like flying in games in general. I really liked, and then you know the space elements is really cool. I don't know. I just I want to see more from Star Citizen, but. I don't know when I'll jump on that. Probably like close when it's like closer to finished, whenever that is, but it's something I do want to check out. You love them, but your blood pressure doesn't. That's fair enough. Yeah, I don't I don't know what it is. They're just like um I guess I've played a lot of them and I just like Bloodborne, I played so much Bloodborne. Um That was before I even streamed. Or maybe it was. I don't know. Um, no, it probably was before I... I don't know. Mm. Yeah, I think... It, wait, I didn't stream it, at least, because I didn't have a capture card. 
But I played that game so much. When did Bloodborne come out? I did, it was definitely before I was streaming. Because I started streaming 2016, 2017. Somewhere around there. trying to gather stuff while I talk because that's what I like about Lost Ark there's a lot of downtime where I can just talk unless I'm doing Abyssal Dungeons or Guardian Raids the Abyssal Dungeons are really fun in this game though I will say except I have to order people I have to order people around and tell them exactly what to do when I'm doing it, doing it with randoms otherwise it doesn't go well gets very heated I want to stream again to show off my office makeover before we move this summer. This move has to happen for my sanity and mental health. I refuse to stay here anymore. Yeah, that's fair enough. You should do a little office tour though before uh, before you go then, if you get the chance. You could even just do like a video or something. I don't know. I oh, just have a little sip. Oh, you've been recording behind the scenes for Patreon. Okay, fair enough. I still, like, I still haven't looked into Patreon stuff. I, um... I was told to make one, but I just... I don't know. I feel like the Twitch sub is enough, you know? But I'm, I'm told it's smart to do both, so... <laughs> I don't know, maybe one day. And then maybe I'll do behind the scenes, which isn't much, I'm not gonna lie. I'm in a- I'm basically in a box, and there's not any room for me to move about. Like, I can roll the chair back. This is- this is as far back as I can go. <laughs> and then other than that, I can't really go to either side. <laughs> I can go to the right, but, you know, it's not great. Yeah, I'll harass you every month with my sub bombs. <laughs> but you know what? There's some forms of harassment I don't mind. <laughs> that sounds weird. <laughs> no, I do appreciate your harassment, Stephanie. <laughs> but you know, it is, it, I do really appreciate it. It's a weird way of phrasing it. But yeah, all, all of that will slowly go towards a new PC one day. <laughs> That's what it'll build towards. And then, I mean, who knows? You know, maybe the YouTube will eventually make money. Because <laughs> you need like a thousand subs on YouTube. But also, I don't, I don't expect to make money off YouTube. Be cool though. I'm not the only thirsty viewer from what I've seen. Well, I mean, you you do have to stay hydrated, you know. That's that's why I've got my tea. I've almost cleared most of these gatherables here, at least. We're getting there. But, uh, yeah, like, what else? What else have we been up to? What else have I got planned? Um, just a lot of TikTok. I I'll be honest, I've been doing a lot of TikTok. And then also, I have, like, a... <laughs> I kind of, for fun, have, like... I want to set up a separate channel <laughs> where I do something completely different. That no one knows about, just for fun. Which... Probably a weird thing, but... Oh! I got an achievement. Will I grow if I eat this? I don't know. But, it's, it's mine now. Hey Zef, what's up? Welcome, welcome. Oh, you know what? The Halo TV show. Have you seen it, Zef? Have you seen the first episode? Okay, we need to talk about that. Nope, okay, well, I was, probably shouldn't talk about it on stream. Also, hold on, wait a minute, Stefan. 
I think it's been 10 minutes. Hold on. <laughs> I think you got an extra couple of minutes there. <laughs> feel like it will offend me. I'll give it a go. <laughs> uh, you know what? There will be parts that you'll be like, <laughs> it will tilt you a little bit. And you know what? I was like, I was okay with most of it. There was like one thing they do at, towards the end of the episode. And I was like, you didn't need to do that. <laughs> But I do think I don't know. Can I can I spoil it a little bit? Oh, okay. Mohoro <laughs> with another ten minutes. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Listen, can I spoil just a, a tiny detail? Okay. Just <laughs> it's like the start of the ep it's like at the start of the episode. Okay, listen. You know what? I was like they start off with these characters and I'm like, eh, I don't know. I don't know if I'm about this. You know, and then there's a bunch of kids that go off and they're like, like <laughs> grabbing some like alien seeds or something like, yeah, man, we're going to get high off these. And then, uh, all, all I'm saying is that, that one of the kids just gets blown up and I'm just like, I'm like, I'm in. <laughs> you've now, you've now got me for another episode at least. <laughs> it's actually, they actually do like gore, which... I was surprised by. I wasn't expecting that, and I was like, okay, you know what? <laughs> I'm in. But yeah, very minor detail. I won't spoil anymore. Um, again, it's, the, it's literally the start of the first episode. But <laughs> that was the hook for me. But uh, I'm, I'm curious what they'll do next. Um... Like, I've seen a lot of people saying they hate it. But I don't know. I don't know. I feel like... It is the whole, like, silver timeline thing, which... Is the one thing after. I'm trying to, like, you know, get into the mindset of. I don't want to, you know. I feel like... There's definitely some things that are like, you know what, that's... That's not, that's not what, that's not correct. But, um, you know, I got over that. There was just one, one thing, one, it's not really minor, but it's one thing. Listen, we'll talk about it when you've watched it, okay? We need to do a whole, whole podcast episode on it. I mean, the way they find Halo sounds dumb. Uh, they don't, I mean, I don't know. They've not found it in the first episode. As far as I'm aware. Unless I missed the parts. Oh yeah, the human in the covenant is like that. That I mean, I saw that in the trailer, and I was like, ugh. But I'm just like, you know what? We'll see how it goes. Oh, it was in the trailer. Okay, yeah, I I don't remember that part. I remember the I remember the human in the covenant. I'm just being like, oof. The only Halo talk I can do is about Red vs. Blue back in the day. I mean, why are we here? <laughs> you know? <laughs> I watched a lot of... I, I think I've seen up until like season 10 of Red vs. Blue. I watched I watched all of that. I, Halo Machine Amount was my thing back in the day. For those of you that don't know. I even <laughs> starred in a Halo Machine Amount or two. <laughs> Do a bit of fishing now as well. But yeah. Like Halo Machinima was like those were the good days. I I miss Machinima, you know? We you don't have Machinima like it was back in the day. You had like red vs blue, um All the WoW Machinima stuff, uh Arby and the Chief. Oh you're a celebrity. <laughs> I'm I'm somewhat of a machinimist myself. Not a, wasn't red. But listen, we don't we don't talk about the machinima. Honestly, you know what? I think the second episode was a a big improvement. We just never did a third episode. I was I was the writer, director, camera guy. 
and f several of the voice actors in the show. <laughs> As if remembers those days. <laughs> All right, three more fishing attempts, and then what we'll do is we'll do our Chaos Dungeons after this as well. Oh, wasn't fully paying attention then. Still got it. But, uh, yeah, the Chaos Dungeons I can't, well, pay attention to chat as much in. Well, I can, but, you know. Definitely can more so than um other stuff, but I f I'm worried it might be a bit laggy. We'll see. But yeah, as if, listen, if you need a link, you know, if you, you need to need a guy, <laughs> you know, let me know. And then listen, we're actually, we're actually going to do a podcast on one of these shows one of these days. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Also, how long was it on the AB2? Okay, just, just double check the time. Okay. Uh Oh, you know what? I also haven't even started researching any, and that's what I should be doing. I, I could have done this all this time, and I probably would have got two done already. I don't have a lot of gold right now. All logs, apparently. Um, Whoops. Let me send off dispatch as well. 92% on that one. That's pretty good. Uh, we'll do the 92% one. Send those guys off. And then we'll see if we have any other high chance ones. 6%. 72%. 94. Okay, I think... I think we'll go with the 94 one. It's not too bad. Actually, hold on. Now the ship is a little busted. Um, and I can't repair it. Because I don't have the stuff. Maybe we'll... Okay, you know what? Uh, I guess I'm sending them off on something else. I'll just do that one. Alright, job done. I need to actually go out in the world and start gathering stuff or just buy some. <clears throat> I love it when people are alive. Hey, Weep, what's up? Welcome, welcome. It is nice to be alive, you know? Mm, you know, sometimes, some days. Some days I'm, I'm like, maybe it's not so nice to be alive, but you know. <laughs> this place has some days it's nice. Take your time. But yeah, welcome, welcome. As long as possible. We've just been like talking about a bunch of random stuff. Uh, I've barely even played the game, and we're like 40 minutes into the stream. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab all this. Oh, you know what I should do? I should go give, uh, I should do the rapport stuff with everyone. That's what we'll do. But yeah, have you been, Weep? It's been, it's been a couple of weeks at least, because I've been gone for, for a while. Nice to be alive when a new trash <laughs> Isekai etchy anime gets released. <laughs> Isn't that like all the time? <laughs> or is it as a new season just started? What's your favorite genre? It's a <laughs> It it is a, a solid genre. I didn't know I didn't know they added trash to the genre name, but you know, <laughs> I think it uh it adds character. Pretty much every season, <laughs> yeah. It's always in there. Need to lurk and make food. I was enjoying making time for you. Well, I, I do really appreciate it, Stephanie. You go uh, enjoy your food. I really appreciate the luck. Don't find you. Exams just ended. Oh, okay. So, you're, uh, you're getting to chill now. Good stuff. Oh, the trash part is a new genre. So, it's brand new genre. Okay. 
officially acknowledged is now entering lurk mode. Lurk mode, engage. Uh, you know what? I will do the emotes for her and then we'll head over to the other areas. It's when girls and anime are basically fan service there to draw out monkey brain men like me. Monkey like girl. <laughs> I mean, I think there's a lot of that in, in anime from what I understand. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think it's specifically just the trash genre that has that. You know, it's definitely sprinkled in every now and then, right? <laughs> Alright, uh, I could give her a gift. Do I want to give her a gift? <laughs> I was gonna read that out in the- in like a monkey voice, but I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> monkey noises. I- I don't know why, but for some reason I imagine as you're typing that, you like- you actually make the noises. That's what I pictured in my head. Uh, do I want to give her a, a fine gramophone? You know what? How would you like a fine gramophone? There we go. I'll give her that for now. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I pictured in my head. You know what? It was... It was a, it was a fun image. <laughs> um... Hmm... You know what? I'm gonna go to the mana real quick. I think I can get someone here real quick. There's the uh, gal here, whose name I've forgotten, who we're gonna tr I think you can max her rapport very quickly, so I'm gonna try that. Also, hold on. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I gave an extra, like, two minutes on the aviators again. <laughs> okay, we're good. I can see again. When we are alone with my brother and I'm sharing some of my stupid ideas views, I sometimes do make monkey noises once every half a year. Just every half a year though, you know. They're oddly specific. You know, I feel like you can you could make monkey noises more often than that, you know. Don't hold back. When there are no sentient creatures near us. Ah uh, yes, that's the uh, the best time. When you can just communicate through nothing but weird noises. Oh! Evac. Um, Money, what's up? Welcome, welcome. Hey man, what's up? Hey, we're just chilling. I've just, uh, starting to get back into Lost Ark again. Just doing all my rapport stuff at the moment. But yeah, welcome, welcome. Um... We're just, again, just talking nonsense to them. Oh my. <laughs> There's one of the uh, the cow skins. <laughs> I've not picked the skin, so um, we recently got a bunch of free skins and stuff, and I have a box for it, and I haven't decided what to pick from it. Um... <laughs> I was thinking what I could do is get a... Um... I kind of want to boost the Berserker and put him in the, like, rat in the, um, in the para costume or the Buccaneer costume. I think that would look very silly. And I feel like I'd be okay with that. Is that a... Is that a, uh, a dog waving? It's very nice. I've... I do agree that we need to embrace our caveman side more. I've yet to find a pretty cavewoman, though. Well, I mean, you know, there's some museums you could check out, you know, have a little browse around. Uh, we're actually going to head over to Pride Home. I want to make sure, I do want to make sure I try and, I think I can max out rapport on the bard lady here, whose name I've forgotten. 
But yeah, I'm trying to... I want to start Max Not Rapport on some people, because I've... There's, like, some low rapport people. Oh, well... I don't know if low rapport is the way to uh, describe them, but like you don't need as many points to actually get them all the way to trusted. So I'm going back and doing some of these people. Like this one here, I just have to do... Just do a sad amount. Very sad. And I think... I think we're good now. There we go. So now I can put her in my stronghold. And we also get a special potato. And the Festival Iron Pot crafting recipe. Go ahead, grab that. That's the first person I've got to max rapport, just because it's very easy to do. Uh, and the other one that I know is easy at the, is the one at the Bishu Manor. And then I think there's a ghost lady in, um... In Annika as well. The dancing Pepe. <laughs> oh, and then uh, the pink cat girl. <laughs> Very nice. I honestly need to get more emotes myself. I've not updated my emotes in a long time. I don't know honestly what I'd even want. But yeah, let's go ahead over here. I'll go talk to Naria as well. I think I'm supposed to have a quest for her, but last time I checked, I couldn't see a quest. You must complete the previous level of rapport quest to express emotes, but there's no quest. Um, I might just not have the correct amount of charisma or whatever to see it. But, even if you don't have the correct amount of charisma, it usually shows up and tells you you don't, which is weird. Oh, by the way, I hope you don't mind asking. I'm a graphic designer. I would like to ask if you're interested in branding or graphics. Um, I don't mind. It, not right now, but maybe in the future. Um, yeah, I'm not looking at doing any big redesigns at the moment. Like I am, I, I am thinking about emotes and stuff, but uh, but yeah, not not right now. But no, I appreciate you letting me know because it's uh, it's something I've been thinking about. Um. I think more so when the YouTube stuff is doing doing a lot better. I think that's when I want to look at like maybe bringing on a graphic designer or something. But yeah, I don't I don't know when that's gonna be. I will say so. I don't want to I don't want to like you know <laughs> lead you on or anything. <laughs> Dude, this is like the second time I've fallen in love with a two D girl, and I'm not a neck beard or anything. <laughs> I consider myself like at least an 8 out of 10. I was voted second best looking guy in high school, so why am I chasing 2D girls? Well, I mean, you know, when, you, when you're that good looking, you, you, look, you look for perfection, <laughs> I guess. And you can only find perfection in 2D girls. <laughs> Monkey confused. For sure. If it's okay, may I DM you my portfolio? Perhaps for reference once you've decided. Yeah, if, uh, feel free to. Um... Because I'll keep your name in mind when I'm, like, thinking about it. But, yeah, I don't know when it'll be. So, again, I don't want to, like, lead you on or anything. But, yeah, you can, like, um, I don't know, DM me on Twitter or Discord or wherever you want to do it. I've got a few places. Could you make a 3D of YouTube character? Uh, I feel like making VTuber characters is, like, I mean, it's a similar skill set, but, like, you know, there's... 3 are difficult to do. Well, I don't know. Hmm. It's just another skill that you have to learn. That you could... That is very similar. Because VTube and stuff's cool. I've, I think a lot of people... Oh, you, you actually can do that as well? Okay, that, that is cool. You're looking at getting a VTuber, uh, Weeblood? That's something I've been thinking about. I think it'd be funny to uh to have a VTube model. You're gonna need a VTube character? Oh, there you go. Probably gonna make myself a character. Alright, yeah, that's cool. What have you got? Have you got any ideas for what you want, Weeb?
Uh, I just got your friend request and I'll accept it. There you go. But yeah, I'll, I'll keep you in mind, uh, Evac or Mooney, whatever you prefer going by. Basically when your semester's over and it's summer break. Yeah, I mean, that's fair enough. I mean... I'm sure it can't hurt to just, you know... Just have Evac's name in mind. Fifth chance it's gonna be a BTGGF. Goth girlfriend. Ah, okay, okay. I worked it out. It took me a second, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> but I also scroll through TikTok, so I understand I some of them. <laughs> I understand some things. TikTok's a, uh, it's a strange place. Alright, so... Um, I'm actually not sure what I want to do. Not Chaos Dungeons, I guess. That's what I'm going to do. So, let's go ahead, head over to the Mark District. I think that's the closest. And then we'll do two Chaos Dungeon runs. And then maybe we'll do some island stuff after as well. All right, I've just got you. Uh, I'll, I'll take a look at the uh, the portfolio. Oh, I don't know if I want to do this on like Chrome is like lagging my PC out. I don't know if I want to do this on stream. Hey, hold on. Uh, I will take a look at that though. Maybe when I take a break, I'll go for it. Music. Yeah, sorry, my PC is not the best. So when I try to open Chrome, it just has a meltdown. Yeah, I'll make sure you're, uh... I'll give you a membership in the Discord so you can talk in there as well. Or maybe I'll make it like an obviously not evil skeleton lord. <laughs> okay. That's a, a bit of a difference. Why not both, you know, weeb? Now, I, c I actually have the gear score to go to the next continents, and I probably should. I'm just not going to do it on stream. Because um, I could do this next, I could do this next set of Chaos Dungeons, but I've just, again, I came down with the, the Rona, so there was like a couple of weeks where I just wasn't playing. As much. I mean, you, you know what, Weeb? It's, it's your character. You can you can do whatever you want with it. <laughs> you know, you take your two, two favorite characters from Overlord and smash them together. <laughs> hey, Monty, what's up? Welcome, welcome. Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling better. I definitely feel on. I've, like, I've got a cough that I don't usually have every now and then, but it's, I'm mostly recovered. Yeah, it's nice to see you again. Hopefully you're doing well. A vampire, <laughs> goth for skeleton girlfriend. Okay. Throwing it, just throwing it all in, there you go, listen. Never say I've, n <laughs> I've not done anything for you. I'm good, thanks. Just busy with work. Ah, okay, yeah, fair enough. Yeah, I've, uh... Ooh, my brain just, like, died because I'm in a chaos dungeon. But, um... Yeah, now hopefully you get some time. 
Yeah, might as well add demon succubus to the list. Okay, you're adding, you're combining three characters there. <laughs> three characters all in one. And remove the skeleton part. Okay, well, I guess that's only two characters now. <laughs> but yeah, you'll have to take that up with, uh, with Evac, because they'd have to, um... You know, they'd have to be okay with drawing whatever you come up with. Yeah, Chaos Dungeons are a little laggy for me when I'm streaming. Ooh. Which is not great. But we'll deal. At least once we're, uh, we're done with these, we can go do islands, and that should be a lot nicer. Oh, <laughs> I just tried <laughs> trying to read what you said then. Hold on, these guys gotta go. Alright, there we go. So, uh, Vampire, Demon, Succubus, Red Horn, Pink Head Girlfriend with like 18th Century Vibe Clothing. Damn, that's the wife. There you go. That's the perfect, <laughs> the perfect waifu for you. You know, can't go wrong with a uh, Demon, Succubus, Vampire. Oh, 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 what the? I died. I died in Chaos Dun Oh my. <laughs> I've never died in a Chaos Dungeon before. Uh. Not, I'm not enjoying the frames in here though, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, let me actually focus up a little bit because I don't want to die again. That was dumb. I don't even know if I needed to uh, instant res there. Because I've never died in the Chaos Dungeon before. I don't know if going to the entrance would just send me back to like the start of this Chaos Dungeon. Actually, I have no idea. Hey, uh, Zephyr. <laughs> yeah, no, I do have potato FPS. <laughs> Like, it's fine when I'm not streaming, but when I'm streaming, the Chaos Dungeon is not a good time. Because there's so many things on screen. It's actually causing... Causing me problems in here that I don't usually have when I do these dungeons. Alright, he's done. My brother started this game partly because I told him I stream out. I like likes this game, too, when he was wondering if he should play this game. Now he plays nothing but this game. He just studies and plays this game every day, all day. You know what? I get it. Is I know a few people who are super addicted to it. All right, we're just gonna head over to the next area. Honestly, it's a lot of fun. I really enjoy it personally. Um, I don't like the pay-to-win stuff, but I uh, well, I don't like pay-to-win in any game really. It's your fault, son. <laughs> That's right. It is. <laughs> I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna own it. I'm gonna take the blame. I need to work on my like evil maniacal laugh. When I, if, you know, whenever anything's my fault, I can just laugh evilly. I'm addicted to Elden Ring at the moment. It's so good. I wish I could play Elden Ring. It's definitely not gonna run on my PC. But I will play it one day. One day I'll play it. Because, I mean, Souls games are some of my favorite games. I love pay to when it's free to play, but the pay to win is cheap because they need money and if the game is cheap, you're fine with it. Yeah, for when it's free to play, I'm like, I'm fine with, like, I can, I can deal with some level of pay to win. Like, I don't mind because I'll never, I'm never going to pay to win anyway, just because I don't, I don't usually put money in. I don't even buy skins half the time. Very rarely will I get a skin. 
But like, I'd prefer if it was just cosmetics. But like, I'll accept it if the game is like really good. That's usually my stance on it. Cause I'll say something's pay to win, but there's like, there's a scale of pay to win, you know? With, with like really bad pay to win and then like pay to win that's like, I can deal. You're storming for other moments. Yeah, I, I need to get on it at some point. It's a good time. Oh, you subbed and you still got, you just got 70. Uh, you might need to refresh maybe. If you just subbed, if it's not popped up for me. But any, I do appreciate the, uh, the Twitch Prime. Listen, that's on Twitch. Okay, that ain't on me. Blame Twitch. Purple site bad. Uh, I'd say you spend ten dollars a buck and you have pay to win kind of buff skier whatsoever. You fine with that? A month? Oh, if it's like a an extra monthly subscription you could pay. See you in a few minutes, I guess. I feel like you, I feel like if you refresh, it should, should fix. You shouldn't be getting ads if you're subbed. That's uh, that's a bit dumb. Hold on. How's my uh, inventory doing? Ooh, ambush master. Uh, I want. No, I need that for the engraving. FIFA artists if it needs any more ads. Actually, there was a few stories I covered on FIFA recently. I think um. You know what, EA had a, uh, oh, I just smacked that. EA had like a lawsuit over the FIFA Ultimate Steam, uh, team stuff that they just managed to slip out of. I think originally they had to pay a fine and they managed to get out of the fine and it was like 11, 11 million. But they got away with it. I think they had to, they appealed it in court twice until they finally got away with it. Or let's say in-game goods, you buy monthly, that cost nine, ten dollars. Let's say there are armor enhancements and weapon enhancements or whatever. A mill is not in free, literally. Yeah, but they never had to pay it, <laughs> which is even better for them. But yeah, I w honestly, they they probably could just you know be like meh and pay it off and not really care. But yeah, I think EA of. With FIFA specifically, they had that issue, and then recently they've been talking about actually changing the name of the game. Or they've, what they think is they don't really get any value out of uh, being partnered with the actual FIFA board or association, because they feel like most people know FIFA for the game itself, and not even, and they don't associate it with the actual FIFA board anymore. So they feel like they can just take it their own way. Which I feel like they still need the brand name. Honestly, I think the issue with sports games is they do the same thing every year. Like they don't ever innovate with that stuff. They don't do anything new. It's just like it's the same game every year, but they just change the rosters a little bit. Is Zephyria made it for the Agia? Are you back? <laughs> oh, I wasn't paying attention. I looked away. Uh, you know what? Did I check this ring? Are we good? Yeah, that's that's originally where the FIFA comes from. <laughs> It's to do with actual football and not, <laughs> not virtual football. <laughs> but no one, no one cares about that. Especially like internationally. I don't know. Well, in America, I guess definitely not. Is FIFA super popular in America? I don't actually know. I'd assume it still sells well in 
and a marker as well. It's literally just reskinning every spawn game. Yeah, that's all they do. They they reskin it and then may, you know maybe they'll occasionally every few years do a graphical update of some kind. I actually I believe was it FIFA or PES one year where they re, they actually just resold the same game. Or it's something along those lines on a different platform. I don't remember the story. It was a while back now. It feels like they um. I think it was like was it 2019 maybe? But yeah, I think they just sold like resold the 2018 version or something. On like on, it was on a different platform. Oh, let's get out of the way of that. Playing sure I'm a goalkeeper since I was six seven. And I love it, but watching nah. Yeah, no, I um, I've not played any sport in a long time. <laughs> no, I, I, you know, esports. I know about esports. Um. Not really sure about anything else. Ooh, dodge out of the way of that. Guy's gotta go. Oh, get out of the way of that. I'm, I'm doing my best to dodge with all this lag. I, I can dodge if I just play it really safe. Oh, he's going over that way. I've been practicing the sports of speed running trash etchy animes lately. I, I, I read like half of that message with you just saying speedrun. I was like, you know what? I've been interested in doing speedruns lately. And then I, I read the other half. Probably not that kind of speedrun. But I saw, I actually saw a really good video lately. Um, oh, I forgot the name of the channel, but there was a guy who um, did a speedrun of Resident Evil 3. And basically he bought the game and refunded it he did it in under two hours and he got all the achievements in the game as well i think it was like trending but it was like a really good video like that's just a really cool concept for a video on my mind you know it's got everything it's got a challenge it's got stakes <laughs> it's got a narrative it's gotta be illegal but technically not I mean, Steam's refund policy is if, if you do it another, you know, if you don't like the game, you can play for two hours and refund it. No questions asked. So, he got away with it. As a law student, got to propose a law for that. I believe the reason uh, Steam have that, like, two hour refund policy is because, um, because I think... They weren't given refunds in certain countries or something, and they got a lot of pressure to have some sort of, re like, no questions asked refund policy. So, I don't know. I don't know how they go about it. No, I was supposed to even look at a rope. Yeah, there we go. I just met a you. There we go. And you're done as well. Okay. Not for the two hour policy. I've got more refunds than a thousand and dollars worth. Yeah, I mean, if something doesn't work over here, you can just be like, hey, listen, this don't work. For the most part, this product is not fit for purpose. I've forgotten the exact act. I, I should remember that act. I'm sure it'll, it'll pop into my head randomly while I'm, uh, while I'm playing. And then I'll, I'll probably just say it with no context. How what you do is play the game offline, never open Steam online from your computer. 
Refund from phone or on a PC. Delete the files manually after uninstalling. Delete any stored data of your playtime. Yeah, that's legal pirating in a sense. I didn't even know you could do that. Well, there you go. Learn something new every day. You know, hey, I guess if I wanna wanna try Elden Ring on this PC, I would have to play in offline mode. Which I feel like I don't know. I think if I'm streaming it, it'd be more fun to do it in uh, online mode. Alright, I mostly got chunk from these runs. There's not on, not a value. I wish I could use this ring, but unfortunately, it doesn't have any of the engravings that I want, so I'm just gonna scrap it all. You could stream all steamers offline, no issue with it. Yeah, I just, I wouldn't get the, uh, I wouldn't get the online experience, which is the only thing. <laughs> so I feel like, you know, then people could join me. I, I say that I usually do my first Souls run on my own, and I don't even like summon NPCs or anything. That's just how I play, but, um, I think it'd be fun to do stuff with people in that game. I never played FIFA or Madden, however, I did play the kids version, and I'd say 10 out of 10. The kids version? I've never- I've never played Madden, I've played FIFA before. And when you get the refund, you could buy me one of the $5 trash. I mean... You know what, they're... They're like the small indie developers as well, as well. you've got to support those at the end of the day. Let me use my special potato. Holy potato it. Did I mess up? Oh no, now I've got the holy potato with teeth marks. Potato, a potato that became famous for resembling the face of Regulus. Some crazy narcissist took a bite out of it, however, leaving big ugly teeth marks on it. <laughs> ah, ah, that was me. I, I, I bit it. Apparently this dish is important to some religion. It tastes like any boring potato though. The priests don't look happy. Well, there we go. I'm actually like... Ooh, I'm so close to getting the um, the lion statue here. I kind of want to get 100% on this zone. Oh, Discord? Hold on. Let me pull up Discord. Backyard soccer. It kind of looks like uh, kids next door or something. I don't know. I don't. I don't remember ever seeing this game. Oh, Monty. Thank you so much for the uh, the gift subs. I r really appreciate that. That's super cool. So you go Ziff and Kelwin. Oh. Oh, I was gonna rebuff that. Uh, I guess it's the. Oh no, there it is. There we go. I really appreciate that, Monty. That's super cool. You are, you know, you're helping me eventually get a new PC one of these days. No, I, I really appreciate it. Again, I feel like every time someone gives a sub, I feel like I don't appreciate it enough. I don't know. I'm just very monotone. <laughs> but yeah, it's super cool. Um, hold on, what did I miss in chat? No jokes, that's why I buy many low-cost hentai games on Steam. I haven't even touched 80 cents of them since I bought them. I'll check them out if the plot seems interesting, if it even has one, or if there's an 11 out of 10 girl. 
to support the devs in hopes for better 18 plus games in the future. You know what? It's a, it's a noble cause, Whip. You can play both male and female mixed teams. That's why I like that. Okay, yeah, that's cool. You know I'm here for you. Yeah, I really appreciate it, Monty. Oh, did you also sub yourself? I don't think that popped up. Unless you were already subbed. I'm not sure. But I... Again, I really appreciate it, either way. Again, all... Every... Bit of support helps. I don't, I don't know. You just resubbed. Okay, yeah. I think... I mean, you need to refresh, maybe, to like... Have it pop up. But either way, I really appreciate that as well, Monty. That's super cool. I'll not benefit from it when the day comes, but... Male grandsons. <laughs> you know, I read that and I knew exactly where you were going. <laughs> True pioneer, you know. A florm. <laughs> just the... Uh, you know, actually... You're out there looking out for the kids of the future. You expired somehow. Uh, yeah, I guess, um, I don't know if it auto renews. I mean, you have to set that, which is probably good, so people don't accidentally pay. But I don't know. I don't know how they've got it set. I've never actually, like, physically, I've, I've used Twitch primes before, but I've not used normal subs, because I'm, I'm poor. <laughs> but yeah, again, really appreciate all the support, Monty. Just, uh, you know, another step closer to getting the, uh, the dream PC. <laughs> Alright, so. I'm actually gonna head to the sea now, and we're gonna go do some island quests. Actually, hold on. Ooh, before I do, I've just realized I got distracted. I was in the process of not dying. Thank you, by the way. There you go. Hopefully, you didn't die, and you got a sub. Hold on, let's go ahead. We're going to upgrade our chest piece here. How do I lose a 77% chance? <laughs> no way. Ugh. Okay, well. I tried. I actually need to make gold. I have 63 gold. That's a sad time. Okay, I'll see you later. Oh, you you going? Okay. Yeah, no worries, Monty. Still thinking about playing, really. Have fun. Okay. I do really appreciate it, Monty. I always, you know, appreciate you stopping on by and whenever you check up on me. So, uh, yeah, you have a have a good one. I'll maybe catch you later. And, you know, hopefully you do play at one point. That would be nice. The more the merrier, after all. Yeah, you have a, a good rest of your night if I don't catch you again. And now, now I'm actually going to go head out and do some island quests because, well, I don't really have a lot of gold. And I uh, can't do Chaos Dungeons now. There's one island quest I can do that will get me a bunch of uh, Hona materials. So that's what we're going to do first. Yeah, thanks, Monty. <laughs> have a good one. Uh, also, ooh, I kind of want to take, I half want to take a break to get a, a drink. It is coming up on midnight. Well, let me repair my ship real quick. I could honestly upgrade this ship more, I think. I. Ooh. Hold on. I think the internet's having a struggle. Alright, set sail. Uh <coughs> Oh. Sorry, still still got the cough a little bit. I'm sure I have ship parts somewhere. Um I don't know if I have them in my I might have them in my storage. I was asking what's my item level. Oh, I'm only 990 at the moment. I'm in uh, tier 2. I 
I do have so many Hona materials though. Like, I could take it straight up. I would need gold, but like, I could have 7,000 destruction stones and 7,000 guardian stones. That's so tempting, but I'm holding back. Uh, I don't know if I want to get any of this crow. What we are going to do though is we're going to go ahead and head over to Bamona Island, which is just around the corner. So we should get a bunch of honing materials here as well from doing this. And hopefully I'll get a bit of gold somewhere along the lines. Remember saying these are the good times in TF3 after that. Know you, if you want to progress beyond the speed of us now, it's pay to win. Yeah, yeah, no, it's, it's very bad in uh, TF3. That's why I, I've been going very slowly with it. I, uh... Yeah, there's, I think on some of them, there's like a 4% chance or lower. It's some ridiculous rates. I don't know if that's in Korea, wherever they're at at the moment, but it gets bad. It gets real bad towards the end. And I know the August release came out a bit too early for most people. So most people, there's a lot of people who paid to win to get into it. And a lot of people were upset about that. Yeah, no, I think, I think he wants to tell me that because this is like, this is the time where I get to relax and enjoy the game. And then tf 3 comes along and then there's a grind from there. I still need to go to the next continents, which we'll do off stream at some points. Amazon being trash as usual. Uh, it's more so just a Korean game thing, to be honest. Um, like it's more on like Smilegate. This is just like how it is. With a lot of Korean MMOs. Which, you know, I live with because I do enjoy Korean MMOs. Like I said, I have like a scale of pay to win where it's like I can deal with it, but it gets, it does get rough. <laughs> I mean, I am kind of just used to having really low chances of upgrade and stuff. Um, I mean, I played Arc Age for the longest time, so, <laughs> you know, I felt, felt the pain of many an item breaking. Real quick, I'm going to go to my stronghold. We've got some research that's complete. He only had one character, which was Berserker. He asked me, uh, to have something else with good DPS. Can you do some research around? I ended up suggesting a sorceress. What do I think is sorceress? So I actually have a sorceress. Uh, she's right. She should be right here. Am I right? Hold on. When this loads in. You're back. You're back. I'm for you. There are matters that need your approval. You can go check them. Yeah, that's my sorceress. I think the just ridiculous. You can just hit buttons and stuff dies. <laughs> they have a lot of AOE where you can just like press a button and stuff dies. So that's why they're my like second character that I've got at the moment. And then I'm also going to make... I think I'm also going to like boost the Berserker and put them in a uh, rat buccaneer costume. That's the plan. Yeah, let's go ahead. I'm going to grab... This research patch is a wonderful beer. Oh, I don't have the gold. I have so little gold. Also. You now craft the festival iron pot. I wonder what that looks like. But yeah, and then there's even more classes coming eventually. I don't know when they're coming. Oh, that's what it looks like. I don't really want the festival iron pot. I'm not going to lie. Maybe at some point. Maybe when I've got a lot of... A lot of gold materials to just waste. But I've not been grinding gold or materials, so. Yeah, 
He asks you to make his character. You end up spending an hour creating your brother's sorceress character. I never really spent much time with mine. I get, I just like went for white hair, purple eyes. Hold on, I can like zoom in. You can kind of see what she looks like. The one I spent the most time on was my assassin. You need your perfect waifu as much as possible in this game. <laughs> it's fair enough. But yeah, and then you can't really see here properly. But yeah, this is my... My, uh... Yeah, I hate the way the armor changes, like, the skin color. I don't know what, what's up with that. But, um... Yeah, this is my assassin. They're like a demon-type class, so I went for more of it. More of a, like, sinister and demonic look. You can't really see the face from this angle, but that's fine. But yeah, I'm falling about the most time doing. I'll probably... I, you know what? I'm not going to spend a lot of... I've already made my Berserker. I don't need to spend a lot of time on him because... He's going to be wearing a rat costume. A full-body rat costume. In a buccaneer outfit. And I sneezed. Um, before we keep on going, I, I'm i going to go quickly make a cup of tea because my throat's getting a bit dry. So, just need to grab a cup of tea. We'll get back into it and then I'm going to start the island quests. So, don't go anywhere. And I'll be...
try it and we're back. All right, I got myself a snack stuff. Let me go ahead, turn the music off. And uh, see what I miss. Hey Drax, what's up? Welcome, welcome. It's been a, been a little while. Hopefully, uh, hopefully you're doing all right. But uh, yeah, what did I miss? Yeah, I'm not against the energies except if they're literally dangerous, but I don't get why I'm doing drowned with the tag on eight out of 10 streams to say. It's, my, it's like the norm we're putting it. Does it get more views or what? So I think um, the thing what is it, Twitch is less and less about just playing games nowadays. It's more so about building a community. I think having that tag for some people really helps. But also, it one thing it does do is it actually sets up a lot of these people as like targets as well. Like a lot of people who've gotten like hate raids has been through that tag. Um, you get a lot of trolls through it. Because um, I used to know someone who would use it all the time. And <laughs> they would come through that tag. But it also, you know, it's because people want to build up a certain community. Which is all good. But some people like showing their support and having a safe space. Yeah. But yeah, there are, there are people who are... <laughs> Again, you hear stories about Twitch hate rates all the time. And Twitch say they're doing stuff about it, but, you know, they're, they're never really gonna. It's always... I think it's just gonna always happen. Because Twitch... <laughs> Twitch aren't gonna take that strong of a stance on everything. Hold on. Oh, it's a... I wish I wasn't getting so much lag. I don't know what that is. I don't know if there's something else I can do. Maybe having Discord open is a problem. Maybe I need to close that and see if that helps. But yeah, I just saw your, uh, I also just saw your image that you sent, Web. Oh, I can pull this up on stream. So this is the sorceress that you made. Ooh, that's not the right one. Which, I mean, she looks good. The, uh, the gold outfit's like the standard one you get when you boost. So, I I understand why they're in that one. But that, I do like how it looks. Looks good looking character. I'm about to sneeze. I can feel it coming. And I'm like trying to hold back. <laughs> but uh, you don't like I said. Don't shove it in your face. I literally don't care. I mean, honestly, if it's just a tag, I don't care. You know? At the end of the day, I don't even look at the tags. So, I think people can just do whatever they want to do. Like, every stream has it now. I don't know. I guess I don't really browse Twitch that often. But, um... I think you're getting a lot more people who are part of LGBT on Twitch. You know, on platforms like this. Because they can build up a community or, you know, feel safer in spaces like this. Which is cool. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't really pay attention to tags and stuff. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Um, so, we were doing islands, weren't we? That's what we were doing. Um. I sent these guys off. The lab. I, I can't really do anything in the lab. I don't have a lot of gold at the moment. I'm gonna do the song of escape and get out of here. And also, I'm gonna close Discord. Um, I'm just gonna try and alleviate some of the lag. I'm gonna hope that helps. My PC today is uh, it's doing worse than usual. <laughs> Such a fresh breeze, the sound of crashing waves. Closing Discord helped a little bit though, I will say. But if anyone sends me on Discord, let me know because I'll have to like check my phone instead. <laughs> All right, so. Is this like a love island? What? Okay, hold on. Let's talk to Lonely Riley over here. This is a legendary island. Legend says that if you sit on the couple's chair in the middle of- Okay, it is. Of the island, you'll find the love of your life. This is embarrassing, but I'm still single, so I thought I should come here. By the way, why is this place filled with couples? I'm so embarrassed I can't bring myself to enter the island. You came alone, didn't you? Could you try to get to the back of the island? There are so many couples that I'm too self-conscious to go there alone. Poor Riley can't even enter the island. I want to make his wish come true. Alright, I guess we're going into the island then. Sound of crashing waves. <laughs> My opinion, there's no way literally everyone is that much of a supporter. 
Some people just top it on the back. You know what? There will be some people that do that. Um, like you do have stories of people like doing stuff like that, but it is it is what it is. It's I don't know I don't definitely don't like when people you know just fake things for views, but I mean there's been people that like fake a uh, fake disabilities and stuff on on stream. There was the oh, there's the famous clip of the uh I think there was a guy who who had like promoted himself as being like a like a disabled streamer not being able to walk and he'd like raised a bunch of money and then there was a there was a clip of him where he thought he was off camera and he in the clip he stands up and walks off and I think everyone in the chat at the time was like I'm it's a miracle. And, I don't know, stuff like that is really disgusting. You know, a person that goes, you know, blah, 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 the moment I talked about this. Yeah, no, I think, um, I think there are some people that are maybe a bit too extreme. And, like, hey, if you think a certain thing, then, you know, you're, if you think X, then you are Y. Um, I think there's a lot more nuance to it a lot of the time, but, you know, that's the kind of takes you'll see on Twitter. And places like that. But yeah, I think the the thing is the majority of people in real life don't care. <laughs> at the end of the at the end of it, they actually just don't even they don't even like see the issues a lot of the time because they don't pay attention to it. <laughs> Where do I? <laughs> hey, Camus, what's up? Welcome, welcome. You wouldn't believe how many extremists from both sides there are on Twitch. Oh yeah, no, there are. Um, I've seen some of Twitch politics. It, uh, I feel like, um, you know, it, it's, it gets, it, it does get bizarre. I think, like, it's a lot of just people shouting at each other, which I don't know. All right, you know what? Can, we'll do the wordle. Hold on. Let's see if my PC can handle opening this. We are going to lag while I open Chrome. It's actually slightly better because I closed Discord. Slightly better. Just like a tiny bit. Hold on. Wedal. Literally don't care as I said before. Yeah, no, I, again, I think that's a lot of people. I think a lot of people don't care. I think, I think with the internet and um, younger generations, uh, younger generations, people have gotten a lot more into politics, especially, um, especially the last half of last decade. Um, you know, with I feel like with Trump, a lot of people got into politics. You know, from one side or the other. You know, if there's one thing he did, it was he got a lot of people talking. <laughs> And, um, I know, you can see that however you want, but, I mean, it is, it is good f that some people are, like, you know, getting into politics early and, like, you know, trying to understand views on stuff, but I think there's a lot of people that don't, <laughs> that don't try and understand stuff. But, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I, I try, I try not to get into politics too much on stream, just because, I don't know. I'm, again, I think a lot of people talk about stuff that they don't know enough about, especially on places like Twitch and YouTube, so I don't talk about it because I don't, I pay attention to stuff, but I don't pay that much attention, so I don't want to talk about stuff. Alright, hold on, I got Wordle up, here we go, chemist. <laughs> so I just don't... Okay, I stop shooting in my face. It would be good if people try to understand both sides just and instead of just screeching in ignorance. The master just talk gibberish without any knowledge. Just hair say. Like it's the collective conscience. <laughs> it just it just makes me think of that one uh, Metal Gear Rising song. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people do just repeat uh talking points that they've had elsewhere. And they don't actually 
a lot of people don't actually consider why they think what they think. You know, they, there's like a gut reaction people have, but no one goes beyond that surface level and tries to think, well, why do I have this gut reaction to this thing? Because once you, I think once you understand that, it's fine. But um, a lot of people talk without knowing. But yeah, okay, so we're going to start off with the best word, of course, paints. And this is just going to nail it. Oh, we got a, we got a piano in E already. What's this game? This is Wordle. Chemist gets me to do it all the time. So, the premise of Wordle is you have to get you have to guess a five letter word, and the gray, if it's gray, it means the letter is not in the word, and if it's yellow, it means the letter is in the word but not in the right place, and if it goes green then it's in the right place. So, P and E are both in this word somewhere, but N, A, and S are not. A lot of people talk about Noah. <laughs> like, you talk about how great pains is right now and what makes a good first word. Listen, you know what makes a good first word? Okay. A P at the start and an S at the end. <laughs> and an A and... I, I, I and an E in the middle, okay? <laughs> I didn't think before I finished that sentence. Recovered it, okay guys, saved. Don't, don't, don't think about it too much. Okay, so. Let's think, what words do we have that have P and E in it? I feel like it maybe ends in PA. <laughs> I think if, I think in my head I just rearranged the letters to spell Snape. That's what I did. Hmm. What else can we get in there? Uh So I can't use A. See, what you, you can reuse letters that aren't in there, but I always try and avoid using the same letters. But if I was playing something like Lingo, then I'd be like throwing a bunch of letters in there. Uh, Could you go for like wipe wiper? Maybe E's in the same place though. I don't want the E in the same place. I I could just throw a viper in there though. <laughs> and um, I could just see what that does for me. See if I get another letter in there, but. I don't like not having the E in the right place. See, we, we can't use A or S. Because uh, they're both grayed out in the top. So it's it's all the same word as we go down. But we'll slowly like collect letters as we go. And like rule out letters. Yeah, sorry. I probably should, I probably should have like properly explained that. Uh... Maybe it's... Hmm... <sighs> Rep... I don't know where the EMP would go. I mean, it could start EP, but I can't think of many words. That are five letters. Let's start with EP. We 
We can't we can't use S either because uh, A N and S are all grayed out. See, I I could throw in Viper. I feel like Viper wouldn't be too bad. Kemp. Oh. Hmm. God damn it, chemist. <laughs> so de delete that clip right now. <laughs> it's a very risky game. I meant, like, the star is... Yeah, the star could, uh, it could go either way. You never know. There's all always a bit of RNG involved. But you then have to recover it from there. And you can just throw in random words, and you can get it fairly easily before the last one. But I always take way too long where I'm thinking about it. Yep. <laughs> I, d I feel like that's probably not a word in here, I'm not gonna lie. I feel like they have a list of words and there's gonna be words like that that aren't in there. That should be tradition now. P Pains is the tradition. And, and Chemist doesn't like it. He gets upset every time I use... The word pains, but listen, it got me a, it got me a P and it got me an A, you know. I just I can't figure out what it is from here. <laughs> letter. Don't like you reusing the same letter, and also E isn't there. You know what? Shall I do this? Oh, that's still not in the right place. It's got a... Okay. The P isn't in the right place, so... See, I never usually do that. I never re usually use the, th the same letter. But I'm just, you know, I'm getting, uh, getting antsy. <laughs> See, I can't use, I can't use R or A. So I was thinking Pell in the first one, but A. Wasn't in there. And also E wouldn't go at the start. The Korea makes you miss him. Yeah, you know, that's fair enough. Uh, so the E isn't there and it's not... Maybe it must start with E, right? It's got to start with E. Hmm. It's got to be an I or an O here, right? Epic. But extra cool, so epic. Oh, I thought you were going to do... T Double C. Epoch. Yeah, I was... That would fit. I'm, I'm trying to make another word before I go with this. If I could get an O and an I in there as well, that'd be great. That, that's a really good word for this. You know what, we'll go with that. We'll try it. Hey, it actually was. Nailed it. Good job, Whip. Third try. We got there. I, I knew it had to be an EP at the start because it can't go anywhere else. I'm a god among men. He's a man, not a god. Come on, comrades. 
Good old, uh... <laughs> the game no one remembers. Alright, let's go ahead. We will, uh... Back out of that. That's job done. Bow to me, mortals. The god of... <laughs> Ooh. My game locked up. But yeah, no, that was good. Again, we'll, uh... Well, there's always tomorrow, Chemist, you know. We'll see what it's like then. Oh, you know what? You already have the answer for tomorrow now, don't you? Because it's not changed for you yet, right? You see, I've never had one. Not even one in 29 years. Uh, what are you talking about? A girlfriend. Ah, ah. Well, I mean, I guess that's not, not, that's not entirely true for me. I, I'd, I'd like to say same, but... Oh well. You're on your own. <laughs> I, don't, I don't actually do the word for today or tomorrow. I just make you do it. <laughs> I like... I like to imagine that you make me do it and then you guess it first try. Just, to, just for your record. <laughs> I came to Fermona Island because I was told I'd meet the woman of my dreams. I think I've met her. Guess what? I haven't. Oh. Oh, we got a bunch of guardian stuns. Okay. Let's encourage him. Hold on. Hold on, guys. We, we just gotta encourage him, you know? You'll find someone. I'm lying to him. <laughs> Thank you for the encouragement, but that's not, a get, not gonna get me a girlfriend. No, no, it's not. Ooh. Actually, you get quite a few max from just doing nothing. <laughs> Why can't I get a girlfriend? Is it because I'm ugly? I mean, he's not that ugly, right? He's living that incel life. <laughs> Hold on one second. All right, I'm back. You always have a girlfriend. Even when you have a girlfriend, you have a second one. You just don't realize it. It's the ideal 2D waifu from an anime. She's always there for you. Wait, wh which one? Is there a specific one? Or just, you know, wh one of your choice? Listen, you know what? Well, it's okay. One day there'll be like, there's gonna, the, you know, it's gonna, there's gonna be virtual VTuber <laughs> girlfriend AIs. That's the future, okay? That's what everyone's gonna be living with. Just your choice. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> well, what would your choice be, Weep? <laughs> uh, hold on. Because I'm ugly. You know, I I really want to be attractive to women. I want a girlfriend. You'll get one someday, kid. Pat pat. Or try to become rich. Ah, yes, the incel answer. Or I think I know why you don't have one. Or let me help you find out why you don't have one. That's that. That's the high kindness answer. You know, we'll go with the high kindness answer. Wow, you're so kind. Perhaps this is what they call inner attractiveness. So why do you think I don't have a girlfriend? Please tell me. So instead of coming on too strong or rambling loudly like this, stay calm and set a romantic mood first, huh? You surely sound like you know what you're saying. <laughs> yeah, I've done that in the past. Haha. <laughs> Could you find a more specific technique that even romance nov novices like myself can use easily? If you do, I'll treat you like my own brother for the rest of my life. Please, brother. Ooh, and then we get the uh, island soul from this as well. And soul. Oh. oh, 
Don't have to go too far for this. Hopefully this isn't too long. She's gonna buy a girlfriend bot like 10 years later. I know it'll happen better than real girls. Would it look like an anime girl? Just but in real life? I'm pretty sure they already have like holograms you can get, right? I feel like I saw a video on that. In Japan or something. Oh, you're looking for something to set help, help set a romantic mood. Something that doesn't require talking. You want to create love in the air and show it in your eyes. A while ago, I saw a man playing a liar for a woman. They had to be the most romantic couple I'd ever seen on Fomona Island. Maybe the liar is what you're looking for. Why don't you search the island for it? This is just, you know, constant reminder that you're a single island. That's what this is. I'll go look right away. I want a cuddleable, a cuddleable one, please. I need a new pillow. <laughs> I mean, you know, you could mix and match. A hologram and a body pillow, I don't know. Whatever you want to go for, weeb. Couples prefer uh, private places. Why don't you check the less public spots on Fermon Island? While you're looking for the liar, do you mind pruning the trees on the island? The beautiful lands landscape of Fermon Island isn't created naturally. It takes a lot of effort to keep the trees and vegetation on the island looking so romantic. And there's only so much I can do on my own. The couples who come here are too busy whispering sweet. I feel like there was supposed to be more to that, but that's fine. Alright, I guess we'll just prune trees and then we'll maybe find someone hidden behind the trees. It's okay temporarily though, okay. So there's a temporary measure. Ruin this one as well. I think we have to go all the way up there, don't we? That's where the Liar of Love is. So this is just another side quest. Oh, there's the bush. There should also be Makoko seeds on this island as well. So I need to keep an eye out for the Makoko seeds. The flower. <laughs> oh, and this is the chair we have to sit in. So if we sit here, we should find oh, our true love. So than in the world. Well, here we go. And now we're no longer single, right? That's how that works. No, no one, no one showed up. <laughs> well, it is what it is. Sad times. <laughs> Let's go tan this quest in first. And I'll also prune this. Wait, where is it? Oh, it's over here. There we go. Anyways, you gotta go sleep. Alright, no worries, weep. You have a good night and I'll catch you again soon. Thanks for the good times, no worries. Always appreciate you dropping on by. And a fast recovery, yeah, hopefully. I should, again, I should be good um, next week. Should be 100%, hopefully. But yeah, have a good one. And I will uh, catch you again soon. There are so many uh, so many couples I see. Excuse me. What? There's a beautiful farmer lady on the island, and she needs help around her farm. Hey, I'm good at gardening. Thank you. I'll never forget this. Well, there we go. That, that was easy. Got a point of charisma. How many stones am I getting from this? Oh, you get a hundred each. Okay, so... Not too bad. I should actually get a few more attempts at upgrading after this as well. But yeah, I think I'm only gonna stream until like 1am, because I actually need to be... be up early tomorrow. I may or may not be getting my hair trimmed, which is, you know, it's a sad time. Thank you, you made my job much easier. This is not a lot of money, but please take it. I don't have a problem with my life, but sometimes I want to meet people aside from couples and adventurers like you. You adventurers are amazing, of course, but I want to marry a farmer because I'm a farmer myself. 
I want to live with a hard-working farmer husband taking care of this island. But farmers just don't come here often for some reason. You already helped me and I don't want to impose on your kindness, but I'm so busy that I really need help. There's a big majestic looking tree in the middle of the island. And couples keep carving their names on its bark. I'd appreciate it if you could wipe it clean. Oh, well. <laughs> we can do that. I don't know how we're wiping it clean. All the way out here just to catch- oh, oh, that's what it means by catch fish. I was like, how do you catch fish from a tree? <laughs> and then uh, it, it clicked. It took me a second, okay, it's late. Love is a beautiful thing, but the trash left by the couples who visit here isn't. Thank you for your help. Goodbye, kind adventurer. Well, there we go. Job's done. And now... Well, there's a few places to check. Hopefully it's not the last place I check. I hope it's not the one to the south. I feel like it can't be right. It's gotta be one to the north. We're just gonna go around this corner. Again, I should be looking out for Makoko seeds. Because I am at some point gonna have to go around and collect every Makoko seed. This is not the place. There is no liar here. Doesn't look like there's a Makoko seed here either. <coughs> Alright, the cough still. Come on, there's... I feel like there's gotta be a Makoko seed here somewhere, right? My seed uh, senses are tingling. Oh, come on, can I go in here? Is this a cave? A little hidden cave, maybe? Maybe here? Like somewhere here, I've got to be able to like go a little outside the map. Oh, I'm not finding anything. Okay, well. That's unfortunate, and it... Oh, they're not here either. It's the one to the south. Oh, no, no, no. I did find it. So the liar was here. I thought there'd be people here as well, but... Looks like we're good. Okay, let's head back down south. One second. Fresh breeze, the sound of crashing waves. The smell of grass and flowers. Oh, sorry. I'm just uh not to get all sneezy now as well. I think it's just because I'm tired, probably. Alright, so whoa, isn't this a liar? Just looking at it makes me feel romantic. I think by playing the liar, I can set a romantic mood without rambling on about stupid stuff. Stupid stuff. I don't know why I, I couldn't say stuff then for some reason. You surely know how to attract women, Marva. Listen, you're asking the wrong guy, okay? This can definitely increase my chances of getting a girlfriend. I'll learn how to play it and use it as my instrument of attraction. Thank you. That was a very... Very short quest line. I was expecting a lot more from that. But hey, I'll take the island soul. Why not? And then we have all of these that we can open up. And we can try and upgrade our gear again as well. Which is very nice. Hopefully the chest piece actually goes up now. I don't know why I've been getting really unlucky with it. So, I also should have even more from here. So let's grab those. And I could get the life leap stones from there as well. These will probably, these islands will probably also give me 
some materials to use. Um, that one gives me ship parts, so I do want to do that at some point, and that one will give me card packs. I do have a few more islands to do in the collectibles. And then there's a bunch of islands to go through as well. I want to get all the island souls. I want to just collect everything, you know? It is going to take a long, long time, though. Not even close on some of these. Got six wild tree lives. I don't even know if that get, gets me like anything. Get the rabbit transformation at 30. I kind of want to... You know, for now, let's go back to Lutera Castle. I kind of want to try and get 90% on um the first area. I'd love to get 100, but I feel like that's going to take a lot of time. It's going to be something I can do to get a... Not 90%, though. I just want to get the statue so I can throw it down in my... uh. A stronghold. Music has the power. I don't know if you guys can hear that. There's just sirens blaring outside the window right now. Oh my god. Norton is loading in. Come on, PC. There we go. Just need to wait for this guy to spawn in. There we go. Okay. I actually do need the, the leap stones. Come on, 84% chance. There's no way I don't get this. There we go. Okay, so that's going to take 20 attempts. Or 20 leap stones. Um, 25 the... Yeah, I just need more leap stones. Um, you know what I could do? I could. I've got 20 of these. Let me try using one now. Why not? There we go. And I can go up again on that. I could. I will use all my leap stones though. Should be over a thousand now, right? Oh, almost. If I take some of the pieces up, I'll be fine. I'm gonna sneeze again. Okay, I'm muted in time. We're good. <laughs> I'm gonna quickly go over here. There's, there's the event exchange uh, vendor that I can get some stuff off. I think I just start sneezing when I'm tired. I don't know what it is. I'm like fine until that starts happening. Alright, let's go ahead. I think I can get some leap stones here. Yeah, I probably... Maybe I should finish up soon. Uh, I can do 10. The life shards I think I'm okay on for the moment. Uh, I could get some of these as well if I really wanted to. Hmm. Let's use what we got so far and we'll see how far it takes us. could just use my mountain go around, but I'm just being very lazy. <laughs> but yeah, I need to do my abyssal dungeons to, you know, get a bit of gold. Do that, maybe do some maps. I'm, I'm very poor at the moment. 
Actually, I should have um, Una tasks to turn in. I think they're in my roster storage. I think I'm holding on to them all soon. All right, let's try taking this up to 14. I assume I need to take everything up to, is it 15? You know, maybe, maybe we take it something else up first. I'll take up the gun. That's level 11. Uh, I'm maybe going to try and take everything up to 10. So I should be at least a thousand now, my gold. Ugh, my gold. I'm so poor. Uh, and then we'll take up the pants. And then I don't even know if I can take up the, uh, the other piece, we'll see. I definitely can't, because that didn't go as planned. Um, yeah, 88% chance. There we go. Level 10 on that. Alright, and I don't even have the, uh, the Guardian Stones now. Or the, the Leap Stones. But I am over a thousand now. All right, I got still got a lot of catching up to do. I again, I can go to the next continent as well, so I should do that at some point. Should do that, and then I have all the other islands I can do. And then, really, my big issue is money. At the moment, gold is like my uh. My bottleneck at the moment. But I should. Not the currency exchange, the uh, the gold seller. I should be able to. Actually, okay, yeah, I have 30 apparently. I need, need a lot more. I wish I could convert my silver into gold, because I've got a lot of silver. I honestly don't even know what you use silver for. Apart from like repairing gear and teleporting around. I'm sure there's something else you can use it for that I'm just not doing. Oh, it's so sparkling. Yeah, I guess you can reforge gems. This, is, uh, this gem doesn't stack, does it? Honestly, I've got, I've got three of these Meteor Streams on. Ones that I just don't want. Um, I feel like they don't stack, but I'm not 100% sure. <coughs> uh, yeah, I... Meteor stream, last request, Meteor stream, okay. Hold on. Quick shot, aim shot. Meteor stream. I have two last requests in there as well. I have a last request there. Uh... Why is that one supposedly an upgrade? Oh, I guess it is slightly better. Because that one's an Azure gem and that one's a Farsi gem. Okay. Um, but what I can do is I'm just going to go ahead and fuse all these. Make a level 4 one. Quick shot, okay, that will do. 
And then which one do I want to remove? Honestly, I don't really care too much about Meteor stream. I don't really, I don't know, it's it's an okay ability. But I feel like it's one I use the least. I don't know, I don't know what gems I'm supposed to have really, but I'm gonna remove that and I'll throw that on for the moment. Just for now. Um and then real quick, let's take a look. What can I do to get that extra 1.7%? Um, I guess for poor. Um, I've got all of the cooking items. Done all the monsters. Done, even done the world boss and I've done all the dungeons. On hard and easy mode. Because I went back and did them all. And I think... These are all done right. So really all I can do is if I can get six of those statue fragments. I don't know where it would be a good place to grab them. Uh, Maybe if I just went like around here somewhere. I don't know where. Hmm. I guess I could just like go around and kill mobs and hope for the best. This is where the world boss is, isn't it? Hold well, on, let me go over here. Why not? I actually think I have like an old map for this area that I just never used because I never did a lot of the secret areas. I wonder if they drop um if they drop items that you need for the If they drop items, what, why is my brain not working? For the adventurers town, I couldn't think of the words. I don't know why. The best gems are focus shot, target down, and perfect shot. Uh, I feel like I don't know. I like my shotgun stuff. I feel like the shotguns, are the best part of the gunslinger. Like the rifles, meh. I feel like I can use that in between. I'll look into it though. Also, welcome, welcome, Hedgeo. Uh, what was. I keep forgetting what I'm doing. Like, I'm really tired. It's kicking in now. Uh, okay. I think I do have a map for this area. Honestly, I don't know which one of these it would be. I've got so many of these that I don't think... I honestly can just scrap them, but... I don't know if they would maybe give me items. I'd have to, like, go through and just check them. What item level is this area? Let's... Let me check this one. Battlebound Plains. Where's Battlebound Plains? Oh, it's all the way over there. Okay, uh... Try checking the lower ones. Like the Demon's Rift, maybe? Or the Demon's Plaza? That's on the border. Okay, so this one... This one I can do. Let's see if this actually gives me any of the... The Adventurer's Tome items, because I don't know. I actually don't know if there's a higher drop rate in this. It was it was over here somewhere, right? 
Oh no, they're knocking me about. I'm gonna look at it. 20 steps to the west. Twenty steps to the west from here. There we go. Oh, and we go for this high level hidden dungeon. See if this drops anything. Well, so far they dropped none. But a silver. Free silver. It's the end of the dungeon. There should be a boss at the end. And maybe they'll drop it. That's my hope. Hello. No. I got a potion. Kinda nice. Uh no adventurous town item though. I guess I just need to find a farming spot. Either that or I just have to buy it off the auction, but I don't want to... I don't really want to do that. I want, I'd rather just, um, just farm the item. Might as well. Because I'm like, I'm very close. I'm almost there. actually use the rifle I have to like ping them as I run along. Yeah the rifle's too slow. Never mind. I feel like the lucky mob or that mob there has the highest chance of dropping something. But you never know. I feel like there's probably a better path somewhere that I can go. But I honestly don't remember the area super well. But I don't know if there's somewhere else where I can like kill a bunch of mobs. Also, how many Makoka? I've only got four out of ten in this area. Make sure we actually have a look around while we're here as well. See if we can actually add to our collection. Oh, a few more guys to kill here. I always hear that noise and I'm just, oh, hold on. I think I found a Makoko seed. <laughs> yeah, I guess I just never came over to this area because this is a pretty obvious one. I probably should be sticking to the sides. This is one of those big areas. I feel like there's definitely going to be one of the tops. Yeah, like there. There's two. There might be something more up here though, maybe. They do give you a big area, but that doesn't always mean there's going to be more Makoko seeds. But also, you never know. So, got to make sure I check the edges. Oh. Yeah, there was another one hidden away. Well, they have three like nested away up here. Wonder if there's a fourth. Just imagine all the Makoko seeds I was missing were just up in this one corner. I wasn't properly searching the sides when I first came up either. I kind of just assumed they'd all be munched up there. Uh... Huh. I think that might be all of them, but also, just in case, I'm just going to go go around one more time, just on this side. So I've definitely checked the left side properly. I know I didn't properly check this side though. 
just in case there's a fourth, which kind of ridiculous if there were four of them all the way up here. But again, you never know. No, I'm pretty sure there's not. Yeah, no, no, no. Okay, well, we did look. So there's three more that I'm missing. And again, considering I didn't like properly scout, oh, scout this area, I thought I saw a pop up then. I think it was just my uh, pet popping in. All right, let's go ahead. We'll hop on down and keep on looking around. So I do plan on getting all the Makoko seeds at some points. And again, mostly without the guides. I'd like to do it without a guide. I just think it's more fun that way. Probably not as entertaining to watch though, I don't imagine, but... Actually, you know, collecting Makoko seeds in general, probably not very entertaining, but... I want to do it, okay? <laughs> it's, it's currently late for me right now, so I'm just doing whatever I want. I'm in the tired brain. Uh, nope, not on that. Go around this side. No, nope, not on there either. Yeah, I do kind of want to check my actual the gems for my build. I might actually look that up real quick. I don't want to pull up the website though. It's gonna lag my PC, isn't it? But I'm I am super curious what they are now. Cause I know they're gonna be probably shotgun oriented shotgun orientated. Cause last request especially is like a big ability for me. So I feel like that's definitely gotta be a focus. God uh, slaggy. Hold it together, PC. Hold it together, come on. We just need to All right, let's see. So, gonna... Dead eye. And we're looking for... This one, okay. Gems, where are gems? Okay, so gems I want are oh, quick shot, sign of the apocalypse, last request, crawl track. Okay, yeah, it's it's mostly shotgun ones then. So I don't. The only pistol ones I want. I don't want any rifle ones, and the only pistol ones I want are Quick Shot and Crawl Tracker. And then the rest, I just want all my shotgun ones. So I want both attack and cooldown gems for all my shotgun abilities. And a cooldown gem for Quick Shot. I don't think I'm using Quick Shot. You know what, I probably should swap out. Um... The Meteor Stream for it, because I don't really use Meteor Stream that much. Yeah, they actually don't even have Meteor Stream in this build. I don't know why I've got it. I guess it's it's nice for, like, uh, when I've got groups together. But, um... When I'm actually doing content. Not, like, great. It locks me in... It just locks me in place a bit too much. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna swap it out right now. See what it feels like. It's probably better once, uh...
once I've actually got some points put into it. Because as it stands, it doesn't feel super great, but I don't know. I don't know how to single item drop. See if I can at least get a Makoko seed up here. Wait, where was the eventual? Okay, I, I'm. I mean, they're all very low level. I think it was the one at the end. Uh. Come on, it's gotta be. It's gotta be one Makoko seed here somewhere. How are they spread out on the map right now? I don't think there's any more in the monastery. We got the three up there. There might be one up by the border post. I feel like if I was going to spread them out, I'd probably put one there. I don't, I don't think there's a Makoko seed here. I just gotta... Unless I've missed it. I could have. I don't know. I'm not as focused as I could be right now. Still getting no drops. I don't know. I Maybe this is not the place. I feel like I need to be around somewhere where a lot of... Uh, I don't know. I think there's going to be somewhere with a higher drop rate. I don't know. Not feeling it. It's not great. If it gave me, like, at least one drop, I'd feel a little better about going around here and killing stuff. But otherwise, it feels like a bit of a waste of time at the moment. Um, <clears throat> let's go come down this way a little bit. It is almost 1 a.m., isn't it? I checked here, didn't I? My Coco suits. Alright, so yeah, definitely not here. I'm gonna leave the like this area, maybe go up towards the border post. And there's the windmills. If we cross this gap as well. So I'm gonna try it over by the windmills. See if there's one there, maybe. I feel like there's a chance. But I feel like there's definitely gonna be one by the border post. You know? Like in my mind, if I was spreading out. Makoko seeds. I'd, I'd spread some up there as well. Uh, there we go. Ah, there we go. Oh, it's an ingredient. You know what? I already would have got this. Because I've done all the cooking ones here. I fought to find out my cocoa seed then. I got I got excited for a moment. Could be one of those things where I just follow the wall all along the zone. And then follow the other wall all the way back and just see if I find them. But you can miss some that way as well. No, I'm not on the... How did that not... Oh! Because my internet just decided to die. Okay, we're good. We're good. Just a brief issue there. Like shot him directly in the face and I was like, how are you not dead? The thing with following the sides is I feel like you missed the really obvious ones. Because you're too focused on the sides. 
but they do like to hide them on the sides. So, I was looking at my Coco seat over there that I've already picked up. I wonder if there's a one on the opposite side somewhere. Still no item drops. Oops. Nope, not on that. I just gather all the mobs on me real quick. That's not what I was looking for. Uh, Alright, well. Let's continue around this way. Can I just stand on my horse? Because I honestly, I'm not, not getting any drops from these mobs. It's not going well. I think I might just, again, get some gold and buy the uh, the pieces I'm missing. And then rapport, I can, uh, can eventually get the rapport on oh, Naria. We'll, we'll get in there. I'm sure I've 100% checked all of this camp. I'm pretty sure I have. So I don't think it's here. We're all gonna die. Okay, you know what? Let's go up to the mod post. I want to check the post. Um, and if it's not there, I might. I don't know. I'm, I think I'm gonna call it for the night soon, though, because again, I do need to be up early tomorrow. We've suffered overwhelming losses. I can feel myself getting sick from being up too late. <laughs> I don't know why that's a thing. I don't know why I just get sick when I'm tired. Go around the sides here. We'll go around the sides of this little area up here. There's gotta be sun. And I, I should have all the Makoko seeds in this dungeon. I'm pretty sure I cleared. All of the alley ones of my cocoa seeds. Kill those guys. Oh, I got plague spores. Do I need plague spores? <laughs> uh, not the one I needed, but hey, I'll take it. Are there specific mobs that drop them? Like the plague spores. <coughs> like I'm curious if the first ones only drop in log hill or something. I don't know if that's the case. I feel like they are just random drops, but I'm not 100%. Oh, there's a Oh, got the Book of the Priest and Plague Spores. Okay. Apparently this is the mob to kill. I need seven more Books of the Priest. You know, I'm gonna loop on back around to that guy real quick and see if he drops more for me. Normal healing potion. Not what I wanted, but I'll take it. Yeah, another normal healing potion as well. Okay, well. Didn't find any more cocoa seeds. I. Probably skipped a few areas though. I was uh <laughs> was a little hasty going between this area and the other giant spider. There could be like one along this path here as well. 
hidden in the bushes, maybe. But yeah, I don't know if there's another hidden area that you can, like, jump up to. There's another Buck of the Priest. This is definitely my spot. Wish we would have found this earlier. I wonder how much the Buck of the Priest sells for. Because honestly, you can kind of just AFK farm that. Just, you know, stand there and just spam D over and over again. Check all these rocks in the middle as well. The big guy up again? No, he's not up yet. But there is the one on the other. You know what? Let me go back and forth between. Them. See if this one drops a book of the priest as well. Because it's pretty consistently dropping it. Got plague spores that time. Again, I'll take any drop. Anything that gets my uh, Adventurous Town progression up a little bit. I didn't get anything that time. Okay, well that's not great. But, I mean, it's been a lot more consistent than anything else in this zone, so... <laughs> I don't mind going back and forth between it. I feel like this gotta be my cocoa seed. Maybe it... around one of these areas in the middle. Oh, I didn't find any in there. Oh, the big guy's up again. Okay. Go find us the book of the priest, please. Nope. Well. I don't think it was my cocoa seeds here. I think I, uh... I think the only reason I want to be here is just to, like, farm these guys. I'm not even dropping them anymore. Sad times. Uh, is there anywhere else I didn't check in this area? There wasn't, like, another piece in the middle that I missed. Could just be out in the open and again i've not really been like focusing my eyes to look around i'm just sort of you know spamming g as i go around hoping for the best not from those mobs okay hold on i'm gonna go kill i'm gonna kill these big spiders once more, just see if I get any. There's already a guy on this one. Okay, I got a normal health potion. And the one there as well. Let's go back over to the other one. And we got none. Okay, well, that's fine. Uh, I tried. Actually, I'm a lot closer now. I'm 1.3%. I really wanted that statue. Did all the demons in the cave die? I miss my comrades. I'm really surprised there isn't one next to the border post. I, I tried to like get close to see if there was one on the edge. Ended up going for it, but that's fine. I think I am gonna like wrap up for the night because I, I am like really tired. I'm feeling it, so I think I'll probably just wrap up there. We got three hours in at least, so it's not a bad uh, fair stream back. And uh, hopefully, I'll be good tomorrow as well, and I'll have my hair cut as well. Don't know what I'm, you know. Maybe I'll go for a, a new hairstyle. We'll see. Mix it up a little bit. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's it for tonight. So thanks for watching, everyone. Thanks for hanging out, and I'll be back tomorrow. We'll be doing. Star Wars Saturdays 
So I can finally continue it in the Old Republic a little bit. Oh, and also Indie Game Nights. If anyone's got any suggestions for indie games, I do want to try and maybe do do something where we get, like, get everyone's suggestions and then vote on which ones we try out or something. Something along those lines. I don't know. But uh, if you have suggestions for indie games that are free, and preferably ones that are like, you know, demos for upcoming ones that we can like check out, throw them in the Discord. But uh, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. If you're not following already, make sure you do. Make sure to check out all the socials. Thank you, Bailey. And I will see you all tomorrow night. Bonsoir.